Hello everybody, I'm Nate. We're making a lot of progress on Resident Evil Zero today. We're actually doing a really good job. Yeah, it's not the I cannot speedrun this game to save my life, because I'll always forget one or two things. Yeah. So we're going to go to the bathroom first. There is two Slugmen. One Slugman spawns in the bathroom, one Slugman spawns as soon as you interact with the clock room. But you don't have to, uh, you don't have to fight the one in the bathroom, do you? you? You don't. You can run away from it. But he's really hard to avoid. So over here in the stalls is a blunt, which is important, and more gasoline. So, we need the blunt so we can heal Rebecca later. And then we just need to fucking run. Are you ready? Hope I don't die. Do you want to heal her now? Fuck you! Oh, Billy gets through. Now in that room, there's always gasoline and a slugman. So we don't really need to go to that room anymore. No. Okay, well, come Billy, on, Billy. Billy did follow you, so you, that's good. Yep. And it didn't spawn the other slugman because we didn't talk to the clock wall. Okay. So we're good, everybody. Han Slugman is on paid vacation. That's what we're going to say. I really desperately need bullets, though. Desperate Cito. I met this crazy bitch named Despacito. <laughs> what, okay, what's your least favorite song on the on the radio right now? Well, I know you don't listen to pop that often, but pop has gone downhill so hard, and it's not because I'm getting old, so don't say that, uh, roadies. I'm not old. I have a good taste in music. I'm only 25. I'm not a grandpa yet. I don't know. I only really listen to uh, the like, oldie station. Which is funny because a lot of songs I listen to as a child are on the oldie station now. Which makes me feel old. You know? Yeah. Because they're playing Green Day on the oldie station. There's the note I yeah, missed. Yeah, that 90s stuff. Yeah. Alright, you ready? Regulations for trainees. Training facility mission. This training facility will raise a new generation of model employees to serve under future Umbrella Corps, applying the strictest, most rigorous training standards in this facility without regard of gender, race, creed, uh, produce only the best candidates to the future global leaders of Umbrella. We look forward to development of your leadership qualities, discipline, guidance, guidance, unity. Three words. Oh, wait, remember this. These three words are the basic principles which govern Umbrella. Uh, they are considered the law of the facility. Keep these words in mind. Devote all time to the corporation. James. So yeah, now we got the regulations, the trainings. We can read that. Oh, at we any can read time. that. I, yeah. I was about to write it down because you said, "Remember this." Okay, I know there's a puzzle with these Do stupid. Do you remember when? That's a great song. There's a lot of great songs we keep singing on this show. It keeps playing spoopy music. I don't want this spoopy. Oh. Maybe I'm oh. supposed to light the fire door on fire. We didn't light the, the fire. fire. It was always burning since the world's been turning. That's the only thing I think can think of that you need to do next is the fire doors. Oh, there's other shit. Oh, wait. Let's try that then. Why is your heart beating? Because. Lol. Nope. That's not how I'm supposed to do it. See, I did forget. See? It's locked. There's a fire crest on the door. Cool. And then this door just has the library, which had the clock room. We still don't know where the clock hand is. Guys, if by, like... I don't know if by a couple of episodes we just don't know what to do. We will look up guides. How much room does Billy have in his pockets? Oh, Billy's got tons of room because he has no bullets. Let's pick do up this shit. Do you ever expand your room? Like, do you get a backpack no. or anything? Else? No, you get one backpack and it gives you eight. So it gives you, as in, instead of six, you have eight now. Oh. Uh, That's it. That's all you get. That's sad. It's it depressing. Is. Yeah. It is depressing. This library is dope, though. I need, a, I need a personal library. That's what I want. I want... See, I was going to make this room that we're in right now my library. Yeah. But it became my gaming room. So I Which need two rooms. I need a library <laughs> room and a gaming room. You, you just need a big ass. We need a YouTuber house already. Guys, subscribe to me and Vince at the same time so we can get a YouTuber house. And we can do prank videos and, like, fucking clickbait. Why are you touching my Yeti? It's, it's not your Yeti anymore. It's my Yeti. No, it isn't. <laughs> I don't believe that. That's slander. Blasphemer. I just, I just traded it out. You now have uh, the snowball again, and uh, I have the Yeti. No. It was so much effort to get the fucking Yeti to work, because I bought it refurbished through Amazon. Uh, my hardcore roadies will know exactly what we're talking about here. Um, right around when I was upgrading my entire setup, when I got the new laptop, uh, when I got when I upgraded my capture card a little bit, and when I... Um, fucking what else did I do? And I uh, got the new Yeti. I got the Yeti refurbished, so I got it through Amazon uh, warehouse deals for 152 Yeah. And the Yeti is supposed to be 200 so it's a kind of a good deal. 
That's okay. But I, like, I have an icicle on the way. So. Oh, you do? Nice. Okay, cool. I can't I, wait to see that. I wish I had an icicle. On the way. Cool. I know the low end icicles are like fucking expensive. There you go. Here's a room we haven't been in before, guys. Hope I don't die. I hate this. And the verdict is death. No, this is a room I've been in. Shit. Oh, God. But there's a guy to kill you anyway. Rebecca, don't. No! No! I don't want that shit. I want to knife him. Cool. Wait. So she wasted a tolly. I would have unequipped those tollies on her. Okay. Good idea. Uh, otherwise, you're going to waste some more. Yeah. And we want to make sure we keep those. Yeah. Now they're both in yellow caution. I still got the grenades. I still got the faculty key. Uh, examine. Are we missing something on it? Oh, it's look. The fire. So you gotta hit yeah. click use on the fire door for it. Yeah. Okay, that's the other. God door. fucking damn it! I hate this game, but I love it so much. Don't you have games like that, Vince? No, I you love the Resident like, Evil it, games. You're like you they're so, so good, but they're so stupid. Yeah, I love the Resident Evil games, but you get so turned around so many times, Turn and you're just like, around. how did I Every not see now that? And then I get a little bit lonely, and there's nothing good around. Turn around. I'm sorry. I like making songs really annoying. It's like that one cover of Sand Chandel Chandelier by Sia. Oh dear. Yeah, Billy's going to be caught Billy's up in there. Be... Yeah, he's going to be stuck in there. So we're going to have to switch to Billy again and make sure he's not dead. Hooray. Yeah, woo. This is exactly what I want. Fuck out of here. Then he gets snacked on again and I have to do that shit again. Oh, As long as you're not in danger. Danger zone. I know everybody made that reference, so... You're not unique. I'm not unique. We're all unique here. I am Billy. We're still leaving him in a stupid outfit. When we get to the lab, we'll switch him to a suave outfit. Back to the back to the cool dude. Pimp, pimpish Billy. Yeah. With the leather I like jacket. the I like the pimp Billy. It's he's dope. He's fly. We didn't pimp the Billy. <laughs> he's been always pimp since the world's been gimp. Oh wait, no, this is the ice door. Shit. So we need to find the ice door as well. Fucking shit. It's just so hard to memorize every this, this, door. This where fucking it goes. map, yeah. So I think it's over here through the big door. And I bet people who've sped run this game are like, "You idiots! It's right there. You have to go through these <laughs> doors. What are you doing? What are you doing?" Boo! Ba do 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 do. We are number one. Hey, do ba do 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 ba do ba do boo boo boo. We are number one. Hey. So, what is your favorite episode of the original Ninja Turtles? Since we're talking about your favorite shows here, who considering I haven't seen the, the in episodes in a of, fucking long time since I was like, uh, let's see, how many years ago was that? that that's probably twenty years. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. We should find you illegal copies of those I episodes. I actually so almost bought them. it for the entire series. Uh, Black Friday last year. Nice. Best Buy had a, a package deals with. Oh, the, I remember this puzzle. Them in in the, the Ninja Turtle van. Oh, really? That's awesome. But so you ready for stupid? I, I have to push this table. It. She's like, eh. Eh. I got oh, it, Billy. Oh Watch me. Look, Billy. I can, you're I not can the only too. one that can push I can things. push things. Look at me, Billy. Are those bullets on the other? Yeah, there's bullets. We need those desperately, desperate seed. Oh, and then you climb. And then you drop down. Because if you push it too far, you can't get all the items. So you need to get the bullets. Yes. Billy is not doing too hot. No, he's not. Okay. There's some shoddy she, shells. Okay, good. She's reloading. And I know we get ambushed here, so let's go pick up the shotgun shells. Yes. Oh, man. Okay, wait, fuck. Switch back to Billy. Uh, give him the shot. There we go. Combine. There you go. Equip. Because if I'm controlling Billy, then we're fine. Let's read this note. Uh, Assistant Director's Diary. September 2nd. A useless bunch of trainees, as always. Where does headquarters find these idiots? We did a couple of decent ones, though, so I can't complain, I guess. William and Albert, they may have a future. September 25th. Scholar Will Practical Al... Who the hell's Practical Al, or is that Practical AI? <laughs> I, don't know. I don't know. We're just going to say Practical it's, Al. It's the Scholar Will and Practical <laughs> Al. <laughs> they, rely, they really are opposites, and they're always competitive on everything they do. I think those There's actually are... There's something ruthless and cruel about them both. I think October those 7th. actually are people. Yeah, they are. 
got a sudden call from the director. He said, fuck you and your stupid voice. It was to tell me to encourage a rivalry between the two. It's first time since the training facility was built that director Marcus has ever shown entrance in every anything other than his research. Uh, well, whatever. Orders are orders. I'm going to have them tearing at each other's throats. I think I did a good voice for him. Here I go. Are you ready for more shit? Go climb the fucking table, you mongoloid. Down. Down. Thank you. There's a switch here. Flip it. Are you ready for shit? Yeah, I'm ready. Mm. Yay, the light's on. Was that a good thing, Vince? No. Not really. No. Is Billy stuck? If I push it, doesn't matter. There you go. Hopefully that makes us good. There's a moose head on the wall. Is it going to start laughing like that evil dead? Oh, what is no, that? No, it is isn't. That? Yeah, what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to pretty much wait here. Are you ready for this shit? Wait here. Okay. Go. No, wait, shit. Go. Are, you, are you ready? Also, this has this episode been going on too long? No, no, we have five more minutes. We're good. So now we get Billy or Rebecca to go over here, and then go down here. So she pushes it yeah. back towards him. So you go here. Wait, crap. You wait, leave him here, and you push Rebecca. Have him push it right here and here. Okay, let's do one more, maybe. No. Uh, then you go Billy, and you have him push it sideways. <laughs> Are you serious? Wow. I hate these puzzles, but I've memorized them. I played this on the GameCube, guys. And then I uh, played it again on the PS4, and I beat it as soon as this game came out. So I haven't beat it in a long time. There seems to be something here on the moose antlers. Yes! The, that's going to be hand. the fucking, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes! Jesus. And now we get ambushed. Are you ready? Bullshit time. Ready. Bullshit time. Ambush we time. Ambush time. Oh, really? I could have sworn it get ambushed in this room. It's probably on the outside of the room. Yeah. If my memory serves me right, I'm pretty sure that we're going to get killed. Hello, I'm bleeding. And Rebecca's not with you. Are you kidding me, Rebecca? Rebecca, you fool in. You're going to get us all killed. We're all dead. Are you kidding me? It'd be funny if uh, somebody spawned while you pushed back to Rebecca. <laughs> and they're just beating the crap yeah, out of the Billy. Billy! Like, like, let's go! Let's go, Billy! Wee! So now we have to go back up to the top of the clock tower where the bugs are. Where was that anyway? Was that in the balcony? Um, I think it was in the balcony. Yeah, it it's, was. In it's the where the uh, dis or the right door here. that was gonna. I'm ready to run. Are you ready to run? Did we kill run. the bugs or did we run away from the bugs? We ran away because oh, we were. Oh no. We were. Uh oh. Doomed at that point. Yeah. Time. Shit. Okay. I'm worried. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. Much point. Oh, wrong balcony. Wrong balcony. Wrong balcony. That's the could sideways you, could balcony. Could you possibly just separate the two of you? Uh, make sure that, that uh, Billy, Billy stays survives. outside, but yeah. give the shotgun to Rebecca. I mean, I could do to that. To pump him full of lead, because if... How many spaces does Rebecca have? Yeah, she can take it. Yeah, ju it just be until you go in there, kill the bugs, come back out, give the shotgun back to Billy. That way, you can go in there without Billy, kill him so he doesn't get smacked around. He's only going to have a knife, but here we go. Hooray! I where the other balcony was. Do you remember where the other balcony was, Vince? Was it one of the side doors on the upper floor, or was it one of the doors on the lower floor? Ugh. I think it was one of the upper doors here. Let me see. I need to remember what it is. I am silly and stupid. I forgot. Was, wasn't that something that went up to the centipede room? And you go through the pool yes. centipede room. Yep, here's the centipede room. Oh dear, here we go. Here we go. What's coming out of the woodwork? I hate this part. Are you ready? Please don't spawn. Please don't spawn. Okay, there's a fifty-fifty chance there's another monster that spawns in this room. I'm pretty sure. Correct me if I'm wrong, roadies. Okay, good. We're good. Because I know this room has had more than one enemy, like it'll spawn zombies in it or slugmen or something later on in that stupid lab room. Mm -hmm. So I'm scared. And on the next installment of Resident Evil Zero, we're going to fight these crows, and we're going to fight the bugmen, and we're going to put that clock hand to 815, and we're going to go to the clock room. I hate this, but I love it. And you should love it too. Hooray! I will see you on the next It's Past Your Bedtime. <laughs>